How could a mom do this to her kids? The words, actions, and decisions she makes with just a couple drinks have changed so many lives. I was only 11 when it all began. She also had a one-year-old, my little brother. She would drink and then leave. My two older sisters and I would take care of our brother, just hoping that she made it back safely. This went on for a couple years, trying to keep the alcohol and the car keys away from her were our chores to keep her safe. We were constantly worried we'd get that phone call that she'd been hurt or worse. How could our loving and caring mom during the day turn into such a psycho at night? With just a couple drinks, our mom would be taken from us and a crazy woman show up in her place. But only mentally, because physically we still saw our mom standing in front of us. One night changed everything. She had one too many of her usual vodka hidden in a Coke bottle. She started screaming, saying that she had to get my baby brother into the car and to the hospital, but he was fine. That night, our worlds almost changed forever. Going 85 in a 30 mile an hour zone, she ended up wrapped around a light pole. Thankfully, only minor injuries were caused, but it was a turning point in her life. She finally realized the impact she was making in the young eyes of her children. She stopped the drinking and started getting help from those around her. We stood behind her and her decisions to begin a better life, just hoping she wouldn't pick up another bottle. We finally had that loving and caring mom we thought we lost for good. The wounds from these years will never quite heal. Stuff gets written on your hard drive when you're a kid. But with every new morning, every undrunk smile, and every good decision she makes, is starting to buy back all the trust she lost. Good. Okay.